Former Chesterfield keeper Tommy Lee has revealed how he took around 4,000 painkillers during his 15-year career after deciding to hang up his boots at the age of 31. To walk away from the game so young looks like a career cut short but it all started to go wrong when he came for a cross against Barry in 2016. Chesterfield keeper Tommy Lee has retired aged 31 revealing he took thousands of painkillers during 15-year career Lee told the Times, the collision was innocuous, the pain was fleeting. But moments later it felt like my shoulder was falling out of its socket. Lee suffered a 270-degree tear of his labrum, a ring of cartilage in the shoulder. After a year of surgery and rehab which involved having nine screws fitted, Lee was still not fully fit and was medically advised to retire. He continued, I was told the next procedure I'll have is a shoulder or replacement, it could be in the next five years, could be in the next 20 years. Tommy Lee wins the League 2 title with Chesterfield in 2014 Tommy Lee spent nine years at Chesterfield, you're going to have to retire, you can't keep taking these tablets, you can't keep going through this sort of pain. But because they work so well, you're not bothered what's going to happen in 10 years. Child's play can you guess the famous footballers from these childhood snaps? You're bothered about the Saturday after, you're bothered about your next contract, you're bothered about your bonuses, paying your mortgage, doing well and achieving things. While at Manchester United aged 17 Lee broke a bone in his wrist. It failed to heal properly and he was told to stop playing football. He added, it was like being hell, what am I going to do? I don't want to do anything else, I want to play football. But I just persisted and persisted with it, and there were days where the pain was searing. He was able to train after a course of anti-inflammatory diclofenac tablets which seemed to help him through training and games. Lee continued, they took the edge off and meant, I could train properly. It was never really an issue getting hold of them, that's probably when I was taking the anti-inflams the most, three a day, during the season, for a few years. It got to a point where the keeper who spent two years at Macclesfield Town could not play or train without the tablets. But he insists he has no regrets about his decisions. Tommy Lee is pursuing the next chapter in his life with coaching and media work he added, I'd be wary that people might construe this as me saying, look at me, I've played with pain all my career, because it's common, and for me it was a small price to pay to be in the position where you get to play football every day and, I wouldn't have had the experiences I've had. My time at Chesterfield made me realize why you play football, why you'll take the anti-inflammatories to play. At Chesterfield we won the league, and I thought, ah, I know why I'm doing this now. For the feeling you get, the sense of achievement you get, but I also understood why people pay to watch football. On a Saturday afternoon you do feel a bit like, what's my purpose? Quote, Lee is now starting the next chapter in his life. He has gained a degree in sports writing and broadcasting and is keen to get into coaching. Hopefully neither career will require too many more painkillers. Weekend Roundup Watch all the action from the Premier League games this weekend.